What is going on folks, TCG back at it again with another video. And what the goal is, is I'm gonna be using some TPG baits. I just picked them up the other day from Ben. And the goal today is to catch some freaking perch. Big fish. Oh, that's a nice pike, Amanda. We've got this nice little pike here. We're gonna go for that jellyfish bite as well. Awesome fish, great way to start the year. What is going on folks, TCG back at it again with another video. I am back out here on a back lake in the Lanark Highlands and the goal today is to catch some freaking perch. And what the goal is, is I'm gonna be using some TPG baits. I just picked them up the other day from Ben Hellman. TPG baits, you already know, local guy who makes uh, soft plastic lures in the 613 area. Really cool looking baits, very fun to use. So I'm gonna be pairing that up with just a little frostbite tungsten jig and I'll put the uh, TPG bait on there and the goal is to just get a bunch of perch on them and see how it fishes. I'm also gonna put out two tip ups as well for Amanda and I with uh, dead minnows on them because there is pike here and we love catching pike. So that's the plan. And then maybe later this evening, the walleye bite might turn on. Not a whole lot of walleyes in here from what I'm told, but there is the potential to get some. So that's the goal. Let's get it set up and get to fishing. So I got my tip up line on the rod and then there's 15 to 20 pound fluorocarbon. And then I got two hooks. I got a little circle hook and a treble. And that's gonna be what's holding this bait. Now a key thing to do when you're using dead bait like this, because you want them to stay down there and float properly under the surface, is you gotta cut their stomach out. They got a bl air bladder in there even when they're dead that fills up with air. And you gotta pop that open or they won't, uh, they won't float right. So very important. Let's go get this tip up set. Alrighty, here we are. Put that down a little bit. There we go. All right, so this is the exact same rig on this tip up, just a bit of a smaller minnow to see if they want something smaller. The other minnow's pretty big, so I don't think there's super large pike in here, but we'll see what they like. And if they like smaller, I'll switch to smaller. If they like bigger, I'll switch to bigger. So let's get this line down and start jigging. Alrighty, so one thing I'm gonna show you guys here about this fishing rod I got is that it's got in, an interchangeable rod. So I wanna target uh, panfish, perch to be exact, and I originally had it set up for pike and walleye. And all you gotta do is pop it off. The butt is separated from all the different rods that comes with it. And then this one here is a light, 24 inch light. And you just pop it, pop it on the handle and this rod is now a light action rod. And then uh, all you gotta do after that is re-spool and tie on the bait you wanna use. It's a very cool rod. This is my first time using something that wasn't the medium, so 
We'll see how these this light action rod is. I'm sure it's going to be good because I love the medium. It looks like it has a very sensitive tip, which is pretty key for panfish. So what I'm tying on is just a little frostbite jig and then I'm going to put TPG baits on there. And it should be a killer for these panfish, for these perch. So there's my little frostbite tungsten and I'm just going to pair it up with a pink wiggler. I'll start on the bigger side and see if that works and if I got a downsize or not, but hopefully the big size worked. They, the perch were super aggressive here the other day, so I'm sure it'll be pretty similar to that, but we'll see what happens. Alrighty, there's the rig. A little tungsten jig. Pink wiggler from TPG Baits. A little frostbite jig, tiny plastic. It's going that way, so pull towards you. And once you feel weight, pull lightly, and once you feel weight, pull, give it a good yank. I don't feel any weight. Keep pulling, lighter. It's on there, pull it. Is there anything? Uh, maybe. I don't if, think so. If there's any weight, it's a fish. Watch out, guys. Keep pulling. No. Nothing? No. It got hammered. I got my pants down and everything. My pants aren't even on. Just grab that. Just wait. Grab it and pull. Just grab it and whatever way it's going, pull it. Got it? Yeah. Nice. I don't feel big. That's okay. Doesn't have to be big. What? He just got off. No. Ooh, ooh. That's a good mark. Oh, oh I lost him. I lost him. That was not a perch. That was not a perch. Not a perch, not a perch. That was a pike or something came in suspended. Oh, 
first fish on the wiggler perch. Finally, ate the uh, chartreuse, lime truce wiggler. Not a very big fish, but we'll take it. Beauty. There's a mark. Oh yeah, there we go. Another perch on the wiggler. I'll take that. Wiggler's paying off. A little lime truce had to put on the small size and there's more fish down there. I put the small wiggler on just cause earlier I had a mark on the big one and nothing ate it. So I figured uh, might have to try something a little smaller and we're getting some steady marks and now the fish are playing. Oh, pulled that out of his mouth. Come on. Come on. There's one. Another one on the Lime Truce Wiggler. And they're nice quality fish. The school is in and they are just chowing down on that Lime Truce Wiggler right in the mouth. Oh, good mark down there. Let's get him. Let's get down there. That perch is still right in my hole. Let's get down there and see if we can get another fish. On the Lime Truce Wiggler, it's freaking killing it. I've never used the lime color before. I've only used pink and white. So, I'm liking this. I'm liking this Lime Truce. They seem to like it too, so. Yo. What's going on? How big? Are you shitting me, dude? Out of Sputnik Lake? Like right, like right where you were fit, like right where I circled. Are you shitting me? Dude. That's a huge fish, man. Dude, a 25, 25 and a quarter. That's insane, bro. That is freaking nuts, man. Yeah, I want to see that fish. Dude, I can't believe it. Oh, I'm about to get bit. My mind is blown. I'm about to get bit. Big mark. Big frickin' mark. It's only 4.45. I gotta, I'm gonna try to reset this tip up, but it, my tip up is, has literally has like a hundred feet level line out. Hold on. I'm, I'm about, not even joking. Big fish. Yeah? Yeah, good fish. I don't know what it is. It might be just be a big perch. <gasps> it's a big walleye. It's a big walleye. I can't lose him. I only got a small jig head on. <gasps> I lost him at the hole, dude. No. He was like 20 inches. Oh no. Dude. No, Ryan. On a micro TPG bait, dude. <sighs> well, get back down there. It's turning on right now, dude. Dude, he I'm, bent. I'm, I'm gonna go. We're going to both catch a bunch of fish right now. Dude, he That's just problem. bent my freaking... Oh, my God. He bent my tungsten jig by frostbite. Oh, my... Yo, send in the first complaint. <sighs> dude, no way I just caught that. That was a... It was a big mark, dude. He chased up like six feet. <laughs> Unreal. What the hell's going on? Dude, the, it's turned on, dude. It's turned on. You still got more chances. 
Yeah, I know. I'm going back down right now. Watch that fish bite again. I die. <laughs> uh, dude, right, I tried. Talk to you. Talk to you later. All right. See you, man. All right, TPG Baits does the trick. I just lost a freaking toad walleye on a freaking micro jig. Unreal. I tried to stick my hand down the hole for him. Couldn't get him. Oh, I don't know. My drag was too tight, I guess. I guess you just got to loosen that. Oh. Doyle just telling me about his walleye he catches. There it is right there. But he caught a giant and then I hook a, my biggest of the year probably. Lo lose him at the hole. Unreal. Let's switch this up. I'm going to put on... It's getting darker. So I'm going to put on a glow tungsten. Or not a glow tungsten, a glow plastic instead. And we're gonna go a bit bigger because there's walleyes out now. So there we go, glow wiggler, scout, watch out. Oh, I can't believe that. That was unreal. Okay, we got a bit bigger going on, so we're doing the only only TPG baits challenge, I guess. Because with walleyes around, I'd definitely like to put on something better. But I also just want to try getting fish on TPG baits. Ugh, I might have to change it up though. I might. I'm going to leave this to charge. Like that. And then I'm going to go get something else. On the TPG. On the TPG. Eat it. Got him. Perch. That's not a walleye. But, right there, little TPG bait, awesome. Is it up again? What? It's not, it's not running. You want me to check this one? It is off to the side. I got him. Whew. Little snot rocket on the tip up. Oh God, so many hooks. Stop it. No. Oh, he's off. Thank goodness. All right. A little tip up fish. Boom. Go on. And, oh God, he's wrapped again. Are you shitting me? Oh God. Buddy. There we go. Okay. Get this back down, because clearly... Yeah, there's good marks down there. Unreal. This is turning on out of nowhere. What? Perch! That's deadly! I don't know what the hell happened, but all of a sudden everything's biting. Alrighty folks, well that's going to be the end of the video. 
I managed to get a handful of fish on the TPG baits. We got a pike on a tip up and I lost a pretty decent walleye at the hole and I was using the TPG baits. Bent out my little tungsten jig by frostbite. But uh, I'm pretty impressed how they performed tonight. Uh, the bite was a little slow at first, but once it turned on, it was just like nonstop action for like 30 or 40 minutes. I'm still marking fish here in 13 feet, but they're a little finicky now. But awesome day out here. Handful of fish caught. Had a lot of fun. And the dogs are freaking out. What are you doing? What are you doing? It's just me. You've been with me all day. Yes, Luke. You've been here all day. Well, if you enjoyed this video, make sure to hit that like button. If you got any questions or concerns, leave a comment below because we love hearing from you guys. If you ain't subscribed to the channel, make sure to subscribe because we're dropping videos every Sunday. Thank you all for watching, and we'll catch you in the next one. Yes, Luke. Yes, Luke. Did I lose him? I think I got him. Oh yeah, I got him. A little perch. That's not what I thought it was. Dang it. I thought we were gonna see a walleye. Makes sense as to why he didn't eat it when I was being aggressive, but... I definitely thought we'd see a walleye.